It's scary stuff, isn't it? Because you can do it yourselves as a couple or whatever, but for someone else's money, for charity money, but, yeah. you know, you, you brought them this, whatever happens, they get £1,000. And at the moment, they're £16,000 better off. How are you feeling, Julie? Better. better. I'm enjoying it. Are you? Enjoying it. Yeah. My best, my f most favourite moment was parking tickets so far. But <laughs> yes. Now, serious business. This is serious. You've got £16,000. Now, this is a big old drop here. You've got a yep. thousand guaranteed. You've got sixteen at the moment. You can walk away. But question number ten would guarantee St Andrew's Hospice thirty-two thousand pounds. Have a look at it. Take as long as you need. It's question number ten of a possible fifteen. Which of these was invented by Alfred Nobel? Tank, gunpowder, dynamite, cannon. I just thought, oh, peace prize and all that, but no. Knickers. Knickers? No. It's not one of the options. <laughs> um. <laughs> oh. Hmm. One of those is worth £32,000. Oh, Mum, I don't think this is our question, you know. OK, OK, let us no, just no. have a look, OK. Exactly. Alfred Nobel, now gunpowder. Um, well, that was... That's very Guy old. Ford, that's, that's, yeah. yeah. Do, do we know Alfred Nobel's date? That would help us, wouldn't it? <laughs> Nobel Peace Prize, I mean... Oh, yeah, I thought it was for peace. What's all this tags? <laughs> We're probably yeah. so far off the mark. Completely different Nobel we're thinking of. Come on. I'm drawn towards tank, oh, but, mom, not, but not, not drawn... to lose £15,000. I don't think we should, Kate. No, I, mean... I don't. It is a luck thing. We haven't got any lifelines. We yeah. could have got literature or history, but... Which is... Well, this you know, is history, obviously, but I mean... You know. I know that polythene was invented in 1933 that... Well done. That, honestly... <laughs> what possible use is that? Listen, I know that thick heads, shags and goat suckers are all species of bird. I tell you... <laughs> I wondered where we were going, didn't you, viewers? <laughs> the things that I have learned in the last few days, and it's been very exciting, but sadly, none of them was about Alfred Nobel. Poor Alfred, no. I haven't got a clue. I... Oh, this is horrible. This yeah, is really yeah. sad because I was really enjoying You're it. Just getting into it. Yeah. Well, come on, time is of an essence, so um, shall we? Which is Red Alpha? No, we don't know. Don't want to risk it. We haven't got lifelines. Should we take the money? Okay. I think we should bow out gracefully. We'll take and the money. Take the money and say we have had such a good time. You've been great, oh, actually. We've had so much it's time. a great result. I tell you what, you, were t you just think about this. St Andrew's Hospice up there in Grimsby, you're taking back £16,000 on Christmas Day. It's a nice serious Christmas result. Present. Bless you. Thank you very much. Just before you give them a big hand, £16,000, <laughs> but just before you go, because your instincts, Julie, have been so good, haven't they? Major tax evasion. Your instincts have been spot on. You knew about polythene. You knew about the goat sucker. <laughs> they just weren't a question. If you'd said tank, yeah. it was completely wrong. <laughs> <You'd have> yeah! <laughs> the right answer actually would have been dynamite. You did the right thing. Happy Christmas. They go away with £16,000. Oh, bless you. It's so Thank you, Thank you so much. Take money away now. I'm going to have a bit of a chat. Yeah. Happy Christmas!